So I made an updated version of my 944 timing belt tensioning tool. This is the original. There's two screws here and two screws there. And those screws kind of box in the, the drive socket for the torque wrench. Even though you've got the screws surrounding it, the plastic itself, if you use it a lot, will start rounding out. It's really not a problem if you just print it, use it, put it in your drawer, you know, wait a couple of years till the next time and then use it again. It'll probably last, you know, the life of your car. But if you're using it on a regular basis, then these tools have a limited life. And I'll keep both of them available for download so you can pick either one. But this one has the same two screws holding or giving support to that tab, but it does not have the screws for the socket for the torque wrench. Instead, it has this hole, and the, that hole is there because what you do is put this set of metric threads into the hole using a soldering iron. It melts in. So you just let the insert sit on the end of the hot soldering iron for a minute or two. And then once you think it's completely heated up, what you do, let's see if I can do this here, you melting the plastic as you go as long as it's nice and hot it should slowly sink into the hole Just, of course the hotter it is the quicker it'll go down so you just let it go all the way down in And then I do the final push this way so it's nice and flush. And then you've got threads that are melted in place. Then once the thread insert is all cooled off, use a thick washer and a short bolt. This I think is 15 millimeters. Put it in there and then torque it. It helps to put it on a vise because otherwise it's hard to get a good enough grip to get all the way up to 12 foot pounds. All right. So that's actually 14.6. And now with the bolt installed the way it is, you could just use a 17 millimeter socket and use the tool the same way you did before. This belt set to about the new belt spec tension. I'll keep both available for download on Carpokes. The original version with the square drive port is fine for most people, but if you're looking for a tool that lasts indefinitely, the uh, version with the threaded insert would be the way to go.